you now beautiful German pretzels. Now you're getting two 12 ounce bags of pretzel bites, and those are marvelous because you're going to get a total of about 48 pretzel bites. But then you're also going to get four of these five ounce each traditional pretzel knots. Now, in addition to all of this, we're also going to include packets of sugar, cinnamon sugar, and packets of salt. So you can dress these up sweet or savory any way that you like. We're super excited to have these on. They were in fact on earlier today. And 1,400 of these have already been ordered. We're going to invite in our special guest so that we can remind you. Well, and, and but as we do that, we'll uh, tell you we're shipping these now and 215 with no auto delivery. Now, joining me, and I want to make sure that I don't mispronounce this, Bjorn, is that right? It's Bjorn, David. Bjorn, 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 excuse me, sir. Nice to have you with us tonight. Good morning, David. Good morning from Germany. From Germany. Talk to us about these pretzels, and is this pronounced Deitch? Correct, it's Ditch. Oh, Ditch, okay, very good. So tell us about this, uh, this, this company, because I understand that it's been in business over 100 years. Correct. So Ditch has a tradition of over 100 years in pretzel making and pretzel baking. Beside our bakeries in Germany and in Switzerland, we're proudly running a pretzel bakery also in Cincinnati, Ohio. This with guidance of a German certified master baker. And we as an entire team are now super excited to bring our authentic traditional German soft pretzels from the old world to the great American people to the United States. Oh, well, I think we lost Bjorn. Uh, his Skype locked up. We'll try to uh, reestablish contact with him. Now, what's important here is that when you receive these, they're fully baked. And what you're going to want to do is pop them in the freezer. They can stay in the freezer. but. Get them out, let them thaw, and before you put them in the oven to warm them, you want to spritz them with water. Now, what am I going to do after I spritz these with water? What I'm going to do is either take the cinnamon sugar or the salt and drizzle or sprinkle this onto the pretzel. We've moistened them so that the sugar, cinnamon sugar, or the salt will have a place to adhere. Now, there's the cinnamon sugar. Oh, smells so good. And then we'll take our salt crystals and pop those on the same way. Make sure that's nice and moistened. There we go. Perfect. And then we'll hit it with some salt and warm these in the oven. Really, really beautiful. Don't miss out on this opportunity. Very exciting. Real German pretzels ship fresh to your door. Now, we can ship these either immediately. 2900 in the immediate ship. I can also ship them on December the or excuse me, February 15th. Now, I believe we have Bajoran back. Sir, it's good to have you back. I apologize we had a little technical difficulty there. No problem at all. I'm back again. <laughs> so, again, did I do this correctly? We um, we took the pretzels, moistened them a bit and sprinkled them with a little sugar on one and um, cinnamon sugar on one and salt on the other. Is that correct? Correct. And you put them in the oven 350 degrees 3 to 5 minutes. Now, when we receive these, are they, uh, do they arrive frozen or are they room temperature? They come freshly, slinging floor wrap to you. We recommend if you do not enjoy them right away, you can store them in the freezer. They will least three to four months in the freezer. Wonderful. And think about this, serving these with your favorite cheese sauces I see you have there, which looks delightful. Yes. We, we did a beer cheese here, which I think is really lovely. I would imagine you all uh, would enjoy a little beer cheese over in Germany. I'm, I'm sure you have uh, enjoyed that. I know I would. And then you can do a whole bowl here for a party or for a, maybe a movie night or watching, your, uh, watching the big game. All of this happens for you really nicely. Make a sandwich out of these. Lots of dipping sauces for pretzels. You could also bake with these and do, a, I believe this is spinach artichoke dip. And then sweet. We did cinnamon sugar on the pretzel bites, and then we, we have a little two little dipping sauces here. One is a jam, and the other is chocolate sauce. So really some fun and inventive ways to rethink pretzels. Wouldn't you agree? Absolutely. So uh, if you have never had a pretzel before, to identify a German authentic pretzel, you always come from the side that there is a tender fluffiness, moisture crumb texture on the inside, 
and a slight crunch on the outside with a little bit of salty taste, not too intense, not too heavy, just a little. Uh, that makes you the experience very good. And um, this comes not only from using the right ingredients, so the, this is only a half part of the battle. The crucial part if the, is the dough mixing process. We call it fermentation. Mm -hmm. So during the fermentation, the big magic takes place. Our pretzel dough uh, aging process takes about four hours. We're mixing our ingredients, which are very carefully selected. We don't use any preservative. It's a very clean, it's a very pure dough. One of the most important part of it, giving the pretzels enough time, letting the pretzel dough rise and develop its authentic and unique taste. During and this baking process, excuse me? No, go right ahead. During this baking process, the pretzels creating their tender fluffiness crumb texture on the inside and a slight crunch on the outside, bringing you the perfect pretzel fun experience to your home. So oh. take this pretzel box, send it to yourself, send it to your friends and family, so anybody can enjoy this during the big game coming up Sunday after next, or send this pretzel gift box for Valentine's Day to the people you love. I mean, look at how tender and how perfect these are. These are so warm from the oven. Just something delightful. Can you imagine this sweet one with a little cream cheese or a savory one with a little favorite cheese sauce or a beautiful mustard with this would be really delightful. So many of you are now making your choice. I'll remind you we had these on earlier today. So between that presentation and this one, nearly 2,000 have been ordered now. Bjorn, it's good to have you back. Thank you so much for being here, sir. We appreciate your time. You're welcome. Have a great night. Take you care. Bye -bye. too. Sleep well, my friend. All right, we're going to check back in with Julia, who's going to let us know what's coming up in the show in the remaining 39 minutes we have together. 39 minutes left? Ah, it's going by so quickly. 